In this video, I'll show you what happens if you rescue Benny from Caesar's Legion in Fallout New Vegas. We'll be walking through some of the unique dialogue for this scenario and seeing what becomes of Benny once we set him free. Keep watching to see it all. Low on the dice, baby. We're gonna need luck to get out of here alive. Another kill to my name! What's up, everyone? Big Dan here. Before we begin, I have a bunch of different Fallout and RPG videos on my channel, so if you're interested in seeing more, hit that subscribe button. Without further ado, let's dive right in. In almost all cases, Benny dies during the main questline in Fallout New Vegas. He'll either meet his demise at the hands of the Courier, or Caesar's Legion if he manages to escape from the Topps Casino. But there is an option to save Benny and allow him to survive his misadventures with the Platinum Chip. For starters, when you track Benny to the Topps Casino, you need to allow him to escape. There are a number of different ways you can do this, but probably the fastest is to cut a deal with him on the casino floor and then head up to the penthouse suite. When you leave the first floor, he'll run off with the Platinum Chip and make his way to Caesar's Fort. When you eventually travel to the fort to meet with Caesar, he will be keeping Benny as a prisoner in his tent. After speaking with Caesar, you can talk to Benny and decide to free him. The first method is to just cut him loose. Low on the dice, baby. We're gonna need luck to get out of here alive. Another kill to my name! Come on! Come on! This pretty much guarantees you'll both be killed. Benny gets flatlined almost instantly. And unless you have great armor or a high level character, you'll most likely be dropped soon after. The next method is to give him a stealth boy and bobby pin so he can escape on his own. Sweet to offer, baby, but if you cut these ropes, every legionary in this camp's gonna come running with machetes. Now, on the other hand, if I had a stealth boy and a bobby pin, I could see myself out. Know what I mean? Baby, your generosity and spirit of forgiveness? Off the charts. This little care package is everything I need. I'll take it from here. Unfortunately, this immediately makes the Legion hostile and they will mob you. Benny will usually get killed in the ensuing mayhem without ever escaping from Caesar's tent. However, if you kill Caesar and his legionaries before freeing Benny, then you can greatly increase his odds of survival. If you plan to do this yourself, I recommend clearing out the entire fort because any surviving Legion soldiers are likely to one or two shot Benny. The guy just goes down like a sack of bricks. Once you've dealt with the Legion soldiers, Benny has some unique dialogue. You're a scrapper, baby. They didn't stand a chance. How about me? Baby, you can't just leave me tied up. Those Legion boys will put me on a cross for the mess you made, if I'm lucky. Thanks for nothing, you think. You think? Murdering me like this, down on my knees? Oh. Oh. Baby, that can go any direction you want. We can take Vegas together, or I can head for the nearest sunset. Your call. That's it, baby. Time to vacate these premises. At this point, when you free Benny, he will make his way out of the tent and proceed to the next gate. When he passes through this gate, he will disappear from the game entirely. Another kill. 
insult to my name. Had enough? Unfortunately, there are no more interactions with Benny after this, which is honestly pretty disappointing. There are so many possibilities for what they could have done with this character. I was hoping you could join forces with him, or maybe he would just go to ground in a safe house and you could visit him later. I don't know, something more than him just disappearing from the game entirely. It's a major hassle to keep him alive, and there's really nothing to show for it. Obsidian initially planned to have a random encounter after Benny escaped the fort. He would ambush the courier out in the wasteland and try to kill them again, but this encounter was thankfully cut from the game, probably because it's ridiculous and doesn't really make that much sense when you think about it. I mean, the guy was a scumbag, but if he tried to mob the courier after they managed to clear out an entire fort full of Legion soldiers to keep him alive, then he must really have a death wish. Here is the audio from the cut encounter when Benny tracks you down. Thanks for getting me out of there. Now for once, will you just lay down and stay down? No one rules Vegas except me, got it? You're a low-down gopher, you deliver mail! How you like being Mr. Goody Two-Shoes, eh? How's it feeling? And then he attacks you. There are mods that will restore this encounter so you can experience it in the game, I'll link a video by Coyote Mob, which shows the restored encounter if you want to see how it looks in game. So there you have it. What happens if you save Benny in Fallout New Vegas? It pretty much immediately makes you enemies with the Legion, and if Benny survives, he just disappears from the game entirely. If you like this video, be sure to subscribe to Big Dan Gaming for more Fallout and RPG videos. Until next time, this has been Big Dan. I should go. Hey there. So I hear the honcho of one of them strip families up and disappeared. Poof. Yeah, they'll find his body someday.